Hi, this is Maggie. In this video, we're going to talk about clipping regions. When we blit one surface to another, we can specify a rectangular clipping region, which constrains where the drawing will take place. We will look at listing 8.6 as an example. In listing 8.6, I blit two images. This is photo 1.jpg, which you can see is 399 by 240 pixels. And this is photo 2.jpg, which is 274 by 184 pixels. And here is the background image, which you can see sort of looks like two picture frames on a wall. What I want to do in the program is blit the images so that they look like they're within the frames. So I want to blit so that the upper left of the first image is at this coordinate that is on the inside of the upper left of the frame. But the frame is only about 110 by 177, which is smaller than my image. So if I blit the image, it will extend beyond the frame in both directions. What I can do is set a clipping region on the background that is the rectangle inside the frame. When I blit, only pixels that fall within the clipping region will be copied to the background. In listing 8.6, we create three surface objects by loading from disk, the background, photo 1, and photo 2. We then set a clipping region on the background, which corresponds to the inside of the first frame. We then blit the first photo to the background, a little up and to the left of the top left of the frame, but the clipping region will constrain where the pixel copying takes place. Only pixels within the frame will be replaced with pixels from photo 1. We do the same thing with photo 2. First, set a clipping region on the background corresponding to the inside of the second frame, and we then blit the second photo. We then blit the background to the screen and flip the display. So clipping regions are quite straightforward. We can define a rectangular region on a surface that constrains where blitz will take place. Only pixels within the rectangular region can be replaced with pixels from the surface being blitted. I suggest you experiment with this a little. Write a program like listing 8.6, but use your own clipping regions and your own images and get used to how it works. Have fun with it.